It's April, and here's some news from us, the tiny but mighty Wraith Rain team. On schedule, we have April 2nd, which is news, what you're hearing now, though I don't know if I'm going to publish this on the 2nd or what. Then on the 9th, we've got the podcast. April 16th is the Empire of Stars live reading on both Facebook and YouTube. So you only have to log into one of those to listen along with Wraith as she voice acts Empire of Stars and its large cast of characters. If you like Dragon's Reign, you will probably also like Empire of Stars, even though it's a space setting and Dragon's Reign is more of a futuristic fantasy setting. The characters are very similar, Jace and Caden and Koth and Valerius. So check it out. The backlog of live readings is on the YouTube playlist, which I will link to. And last on the 23rd, it's Dragon's Reign podcast. We do publish the Dragon's Reign podcast every week, but we ran out of space on the Wraith Reign schedule to put it down for every week. So it's there. It's just not marked on the calendar because we have to have the space for other stuff. Speaking of <laughs> cluttering up our calendar, I don't know if you've noticed, but we are also doing more of the mini podcasts. These are more informational, either about us or about topics that interest us that we want to get discussion going. And we post those through the main podcast channel and also on the YouTube channel for people who want to come discuss. As for chapters, Three Everdark Academy, Three Empire of Stars, Three Wicked Path, and Three Labyrinth. As you know, the Dragon's Raiden podcast has returned. We just put out episode 128, which means that there are only 12 left. It's hard to believe this has been a three-year project. The last Dragon's Reign will be at the end of June if we're planning this out correctly. And then the new one will probably start up a couple weeks into July. Books and audiobooks. Cinders and Ashes 5 came out just a couple of weeks ago. Thank you to everyone who has left reviews. It would be super awesome if a few of you could keep doing that, just so Amazon knows the series is still relevant. It's a book five, so reviews definitely fall off after the first couple books. The more activity there is on an Amazon page, the more Amazon will realize that the book is relevant, people are reading it now, and that they should show it to more people. So book six, which is going to be the last book of the series, I thought it would be scheduled for late fall, but it turns out I was wrong. She decided to do it in August. After that, I don't know what she's planning for the next book series. I mean, she's kicked around ideas and gotten some concept covers made, but everything is changeable when it comes to Wraith and what she really feels like doing. So I guess we'll all find out when it gets closer to the time. We expect the audiobook for Cinders and Ashes 5 to start recording soon if Edward and Hannah haven't done it already. Free stuff. It's Merman month, so we're doing Merman 1, which will be free April 7th to 11th, and Merman 3, which will be free April 21 to 25. Social stuff. We're having fun with short content. The same shorts are run to TikTok, YouTube, and Instagram, so if you're only on one of the platforms, you're not missing anything. We check them all, and YouTube's probably the best place to comment just because of the comments formatting. It's less awkward on YouTube to have a conversation. TikTok is weird, and Instagram, I don't know. <laughs> I, like, I don't respond to the Instagram comments. That's, uh, that's all Wraith. Speaking of, I'm treating the social channels as mostly one-way communication between us and you, except for the comments. We don't really want to make anyone feel like we're watching because self-expression is really important to us, obviously, and we never want to make anyone feel like they have to modify what they say and do just because we might see it. If you do want us to see what you do, go ahead and mention us. On TikTok and Instagram, we are WraithRain, one word. We're not really on Twitter. Like, we get auto tweets published to Twitter, but it's more Wraith's personal account and she's hardly ever on it, so. Community creations. We got some amazing fan art and videos this month. 
First, here's Eleanor Willow with Wraith's birthday art and some Wicked Path chibis. Lopter, spelled L-O-P-T-R, made us art and animation from Dragon's Reign. Here's Caden in a black dragon hoodie, which I would totally buy, and animation of Caden's heroic moment when he bonds with Iolair. Andre and Elin collaborated to make this animated image of fire-breathing Raziel. They actually worked together on indie games, and I will post links to their channels and various pages. Andre is Jefak, J-E-F-A-W-K, and Elin is Frost Knight, and is also a fantasy illustrator, obviously, and a fantasy writer. And Ness made this music video to a song called Guy.exe by Superfruit with Wraith Rain characters. I think this is done in The Sims. I don't know anything about Sims. I mean, obviously I know it exists, but I've never played. So I don't really know how Ness got the characters to dance. Are these built-in emotes like Fortnite? <laughs> I'm more of a uh, ARPG and first-person shooter player, so. Anyway, this is really well done. And all these creators deserve your direct appreciation. So instead of showing all the stuff here, hop on over to their own YouTube channels or websites and leave a comment, like, subscribe, show them some love. We have been getting more and more fan works recently, and I'm always afraid I'm going to miss stuff because sometimes they get sent to me, sometimes to Wraith, who forwards them to me, and even my business inbox gets full of business spam. So... I'm thinking about setting up a formal fan art submission system, maybe with just like Google Forms or something so that you guys can put in your links and your relevant like social media handles if you care about that and just, you know, want to get more organized since that is literally my job. Anyway, if you have any suggestions about how to do this, let me know in the comments or email me directly. I'm marketing at wraithrain.com as you probably already know. If you do art and want to tag us on social media, links are in the notes. The biggest fan work repository is, of course, on the Discord channel. The Discord invite is posted in the notes, and that's basically the news. Hopefully I didn't miss anything or leave out anybody, but if so, let me know and I'll get you next time. Bye!